What up, guys? This is Fisanity from the Sitspa channel. Another video here again regarding my crypto mining journey. And today I want to talk about、um, crypto mining on your gaming laptop. Now I've been doing this since January 10th, over two months already. And a few days ago, this is what happened. Look at the photo in the back. So. Yeah, as you can see, this is my gaming laptop, the one that I'm using to record this video, the one that I use to live stream, the one that I use to do some gaming sometimes, and live streaming at the same time. Before, if you follow my channel closely, and you notice there's a bulge. Basically, the bezel of my laptop expanded, and why? It's because the battery. The battery, you know, these lithium-ion batteries is is known to expand if it's used for like extensive time. Like it, that, it happens on phones, happens on any lithium-ion battery, whatever. So as you guys can see, this is what happened. There's like a bulge. So I don't know. You guys could probably see it. So that caused that. My laptop to explode, <laughs> Par partially. The screw just popped out. I don't even. I don't even know where it went. And so, I was like, "Shit!" I guess there goes my laptop. And then I asked my friend. He's like, "I showed this photo to my friend. He's like, 'Oh, just replace the battery, and then you're good to go.' So that's what I did. So I didn't make a video about that, but that's what I did. So there you go. I opened up the laptop. And took out the battery, and yeah, there's like this this connector connects to the laptop. So luckily, this laptop can still operate without the battery. I don't know. Some laptops maybe requires the battery to be plugged in, and but it's okay. This laptop does now does not have a battery. Well, I never you really bring this laptop out anywhere. Anyways, it's I use it as a desktop basically. So. I don't really need a battery, to be honest. So yeah, I have to. Re so I remove this fire hazard, <laughs> basically, because if I continue to have this thing plugged in and keep mining, it's gonna explode, and that's gonna cause a lot of problems. So it's better to get rid of the source of the problem late soon. And I might order a battery from Taobao or something. They cost like. A few hundred bucks, Hong Kong dollars. It's not like super expensive. Like, but I think they're like not. I don't know if they're OEM though, the the cheaper ones. I I see them. I I see the authentic razor ones selling for like nine hundred Hong Kong dollars, seven hundred Hong Kong dollars, like almost a hundred bucks USD. So I don't know. I'm not in a hurry to do this. So. So yeah, after taking out the battery, I'm back in business. I'm mining again. And for the laptop, I use a different. Miner, and it's called Kudo Miner, which is what I want to talk about today.、Um, this is actually the first mining OS software that I used、um, because I was a noob. I just went Google. I just Google、uh, crypto mining, and then this this software came out, and it's very easy to use. It's got a very simple、um, user interface. Good for noobs like me. If you're new to mining,、uh, definitely I recommend this because some of the other miners or、uh, software or pools are a little bit more complicated. They don't have a user interface. Like for example, EtherMine.org. It's another. It's another level of stuff. Yeah, you gotta know how to run bash files and stuff. It's 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 a, it's another level. If you're not really、um, techy, you're not really into. Uh, software or tech stuff. I think this is a good, good platform to begin with, and then you can move on to the other more complicated stuff. Obviously, I'm actually mining right now, but it's not really doing any. As you can see, my hash rate is only at like, yeah, barely have any because I'm recording while I'm mining. So because I'm recording, it's taking up a lot of the GPU's.、Um, Uh, what's it called? The、uh, the workload. So therefore, 
the hash rate is damn low as you can see 2.55 mega hash normally this laptop uh, this razor blade 15 10 60 max Q can do 17 ish on a good day 17 18 mega hash if the if my room is cooler it could actually do like 19 20 mega hash without any overclock okay this is a laptop so I'll show you it's got all the stats you can see the history this is the dashboard I I just say I disabled the CPU mining because it's not really worth it so I'm only mining uh, with the video card and it's very simple to use it's got yeah it's all like um, it's all there basically you, you you can just do trial and error you can launch you choose to launch and start up earn when started and then you can choose what algorithm to mine I disable the Bitcoin stuff I'm actually mining Ravencoin right now I'll show you guys on the web they also have the a web interface as well as a uh, an app that you download onto Windows okay the one that I just showed you just now was the the dashboard the Kudo miner uh, app right now this is the web this is the web interface so the beauty of this this uh, Kudo miner is uh, you can choose what coin to mine actually in the beginning I, I mined some Bitcoin and then I went over to Ethereum now I'm trying I'm trying Ravencoin all right so here you can see these the the my my balance that I have in the account so far I've mined some Bitcoin but I already, ex I already um, withdrew those earlier I have some Ethereum left 155 USD of Ethereum and now I'm trying Ravencoin just for fun yeah just for fun yeah because I, I think that coin has some potentials so and you can see all the transactions so they will pay pay out to your account daily yeah so as you can see I have 64 pages 64 days of uh, transactions so as you can see in the beginning I was mining some Bitcoin and then I switched over to Ethereum after I got some I got I I, I, ex I withdrew some payout yeah you can see I withdrew hundred and twenty two dollars of Bitcoin and then I, I, I went over to Ethereum, mined Ethereum for a bit. Yeah, and then switched over to Ravencoin and then my battery exploded. Then I kind of got a little bit worried, but now I'm back in business. Yeah, but yeah, if you are if you have a laptop, I mean, you could try, but there are concerns about mining of a laptop because it gets very hot because it's totally different from a desktop GPU. The heat dissipation it's a lot worse it's really hot like my laptop right now is like 91 degrees the GPU yeah, as you can see see it's 91 degrees so heat wise is not good but laptop uses lower wattages than desktops so that's one advantage so but if knock on wood if your GPU does go bad it's gonna be expensive to replace it because it's on a laptop it's soldered to your motherboard and stuff I don't know how complicated it is to fix it it's definitely gonna be worse than mining with a desktop GPU but I mean if you got a spare laptop gaming laptop lying around that you don't really use and you only use once a, a week for gaming and then the rest of the week is just sitting there maybe you can consider I mean because mining crypto mining is very profitable right right now so why not make some passive income with the idle time of your hardware that's my thinking yeah so yeah that's what I want to say mining with a laptop is possible and as you guys saw I made some money in two months with a laptop now those numbers were, were with two laptops actually okay not with just one I had another laptop at my, my wife's office but I've since sold that laptop already it was a Razorblade 14 
same GPU as this one. Yeah. So, I mean, made some money. A few hundred bucks USD in two months. Yeah, so, not bad. All right, so, yeah. That's all I want to say. And if you want to try Kudo Miner, please use my affiliate link in the description below. You can sign up with that link. And if you're new to crypto, you don't have a wallet, use the Coinbase link I have in the description. And finally, if you're into trading cryptocurrency, use my Binance referral link, okay? That will be greatly appreciated, all right? Help me out. And most important of all, subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next video. Keep mining.